Good evening, Modesto. Again, I'm Bob Brinkman. And I'm Veronica Shapley. Tonight, surprising news. For years, mankind has pondered the question, are we alone in the universe? Well, tonight, we have our answer. We do? Uh, I mean, we do, Veronica. Thank you, Bob. Ernie, can we roll that clip? Greetings, people of Earth. Behold, I am Galaxar, and I will soon be the ruler of the entire universe. I have come for my Quantonium. Give it to me at once. Wow, will you look at that? He appeared in every major city in every corner of the globe, addressing them in their own language. Bonjour les gens de la terre. Salute la gente de terra earthy. I say hello you lot down there on terra firma. I want my quantonium. Give it to me or I will annihilate your puny planet. Release the scorpion robot e thingy. Go, my pet. Find my quantonium. Find this human female. She has my quantonium. For the record, I do not have his quantuminium. Uh, quantonium. Whatever. I wouldn't worry about that, Susan. That alien misfit has not only invaded the airspace of the good old US of A, but I'm sure has also violated about 700 FCC regulations with that fancy sky projector of his. And one thing those Washington boys did not take kindly to is people who monkey around with their rules and regs. Wardrobe malfunctions included. Hoorah. What in the heck? Detroit, report. What was that? Whatever it was, General, it seems to have hit the ground. Very close by. All right, everyone, spread out. Time to get some recon. Huh? Okay, I see it. Oh boy, it's another robot. But, General, I'm looking at this thing, and I tell you, the only thing we need to get is gone. Call in the jets? The Marines, the Mounties, anyone. Let's beat feet out of Aliensville. This one is too much. Hate to tell you this, son, but there is no one else. SAC Command says they moved against the alien ship. Couldn't even scratch its paint job. It really is just us now. Hmm, there must be a force field protecting the ship. But this robot doesn't appear to have one. Maybe it was damaged in the impact. Well, that's something at least. Oh no! Susan, it sees you! What? Insecto, buddy. This one is Major League Serious. Insectosaurus! No! Wait, Bob! Don't go out there! Bob! Bob! What are you doing? I'm calling this bad guy out. Relax, I've seen it a thousand times on TV. But this isn't TV, Bob. Bob! Okay, Varmint, it's just you and me now. Your boo! Okay! How did you do that? Uh, never mind. You appear to be in the Central Optical Power Complex, a veritable labyrinth of technological wonder. Uh, don't look now, but they've got one heck of a light show at the other end of that hallway. My advice? I keep out of its way. Bob, those shield platforms will protect you from the laser. As you think you may go with the ball.
Now I really do feel like a big rat. Speak, speak! Hi there, I'm a big rat! Where's the cheese, please? <laughs> Bob, stop it. You are not a rat. And don't let the room's complexity throw you. It's a simple maze for someone with your unique abilities. Just be careful. Right, Doc. I am not a rat. Got it. Uh, so where did you say the cheese was again? Oh, boy. Your targets are the generators within this complex. Understand? You'll need to take them offline any way you can.
There's the first generator, Bob. Quickly, take it out. But you've got more work to do. Hop to it. Definitely some cheese in here. Look, Bob, please. Forget the cheese. Forget mazes. Forget rats. Forget everything. Just think how you're going to get past the robot defenses to the generator, okay? The generator is on the far side, Bob. Be careful. That's it. Right the gears over there. Bob, watch out for the steam jets! Ah. 
Here they come! Job, son. You made it to the second inning. Now, let her rest. Power is down significantly inside the Scorpion robot. That's a good start. Bob, get into your next position so we can finish it off. Okie dokie. The missing link, are you there? What have you got? Outstanding work. Shake your hand! 